Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And so I got a new video for you with uh, some new stuff and I did my hair so who knows what color it is now. Um, but I thought I'd go ahead and get started with what's on my face today. I have the ColourPop uh, Pretty Fresh on and then I also have the Pretty Fresh uh, concealer as well. And both of those are from ColourPop. You can get those at the ColourPop website um, or at Ulta. And then as far as my blush, I went, into, I went ahead and did a combination of Rare, Rare Beauty Hope and um, Sounds Great by ColourPop. So I mixed these two together. And then um, I did go ahead and add in the Sungasm as far as the bronzer. And this is by Catrice. It's 02 is the shade. And I went ahead and added in the Soul Bronze Hour as well. And so that's the way this one looks. And it goes from a white gold to a golden. So yeah, it could definitely be a holographic one as well. And I went ahead and mixed in a little bit of Comet Catcher by Kaleidos as far as going ahead and doing the highlighter. And this is the way that that looks swatched. So it has another um, holographic kind of glow to it. Now if you can tell, maybe I can get a better swatch here. Yeah, you can see it a little bit. The pink there. Yeah, that's it. So it comes off a little bit pink. And again, it's by Kaleidos. It's called the Comet Catcher. And I uh, also have on some of the Lifter Gloss, and this one is 004, so that's what I have on there. And let's see, as far as eyeshadow, went ahead and did Smoke and Roses today. And I have to tell you, I am feeling, I have more desk room right now than I've had in at least four months. I got some new organizational, and I'll show you here in a second, but I got one of those. Um, it's three shelves, and it's actually for uh, nail polish, yeah, nail polish holders. And so I went ahead and put my um, foundations up there, and I thought, oh, I'll have extra room and everything. No, I don't any extra room. It took it all up, but uh, it opened up room everywhere because I had had tints here and foundations there and concealers, you know, just all over the place. So yeah, organization's a wonderful thing. I'll show you some pictures. And so Smoke and Roses um, was what I used and went ahead and used this one on the inner corner. And then uh, this one on the lid, and this one um, in the crease. So this is the way that this turned out. And again, Smoke and Roses is beautiful. Yes, I have smudges because I like it and I use it. And um, so it's a wonderful palette. Always recommending this palette. Uh, for a lot of people, it is a great everyday palette. And it's so small that it fits in one hand, so if you want to, I mean, you can go ahead and hold it with one hand and do your makeup with your other one. So it's a really good palette, and it's small enough that you don't feel like you're going to be, you know, doing, doing arm lifts or anything while you're doing your makeup. So yeah, really nice palette by ColourPop. And let's see what else. Else. Oh, I was going to go ahead and add in some liner since I haven't done that yet. And uh, there we go. There it is with a little bit of the burgundy liner with it, which probably helps out quite a lot. But like I said, I'm just so amazed that I have so much room left. And I'm going to go ahead and put this back up there. And I'll go ahead and show you. So there you go. And as you can see, it has the three shelves on it. 
and I've gone ahead and used every inch of space that there is in there. Um, but it just opened up so much space everywhere else that I'm... And there we go. So I think that's just about all of the video. And um, thank you and have a great day. And um, I'll see you later, okay? Bye.